Breaking news from the waterfront tonight. A search is underway in the harbor after someone fell off a boat. Good evening, everybody. I'm Kate Merrill. Thanks for joining us tonight. That boater was then hit by the propeller in the water. Our Jim Smith is live on the waterfront with all the breaking details. Jim? Kate, I'm at the Black Falcon Terminal. This is where the Boston Police Harbor Patrol is based, and this is apparently where this victim was brought in tonight. Let's show you the scene as it unfolded. According to late information from the Coast Guard, a woman went overboard on a pleasure boat out by Spectacle Island. At some point, while she was being pulled back into the boat, she came in contact with the boat's propeller, severing her arm at the shoulder and causing other serious wounds. A Boston EMS official couldn't say much because of patient privacy, but he did speak with us. Basically, it looks like it was from a boating accident. I really don't have much more than that at this time, unfortunately. Did it appear to be significant wounds? Um, the, the patient was injured. I really can't get that much into it. But it was on a boat somewhere out in the water? My understanding is, uh, yes, it was involving a boat. So she was transported, though? She was transported by EMTs and paramedics from Boston EMS. The Coast Guard tonight says there were 13 people on that boat. When they got there, there were five other people in the water, we believe, trying to help this victim. They were fished out of the water, brought in safely to shore by the Coast Guard. The woman who was badly injured, she was brought to Mass General Hospital with what Boston police described tonight as life-threatening injuries. According to radio traffic, even tonight, the Coast Guard was apparently actually searching the waters for that woman's arm. We can only assume possibly so that doctors could hopefully reattach it. We don't know what the status of that is. Just an absolutely gruesome story. Boston police continue to investigate. Live on the waterfront, Jim Smith, WBZ News.